for the second straight game, the Phoenix Suns get a big time shot from a guy who's becoming Mr. Big Shot. Channing Fry gets the game winner in Indianapolis against the Pacers at the buzzer, and then a big three-pointer with six seconds left to go against the Nets in Newark. But it definitely didn't need to be that way against the Nets. The Suns made some key mistakes down the stretch from guys you'd never expect to make those mistakes, namely Steve Nash fouling Anthony Morrow on a three-point attempt that gave him three free throws to tie the game and send it to overtime, and Grant Hill with a chance to get the ball inbounded for a game-winning shot in regulation ended up getting a five-second call. These are things that you don't expect to happen from these captains, but the good news is for the Suns, they keep the winning rolling as they now won four in a row, five straight on the road. They finished the month of February 9-3, and three, their best month of the season by far, and it does seem like confidence continues to build. Now this road trip gets a little tougher, though. Two of the next three games against very good competition against the Boston Celtics, and then they go to Milwaukee, and then they finish up at Oklahoma City. As of now, though, this trip has got off to a great start. Three straight wins, and the Suns now four games over 500 for the first time all season. With this Suns recap, I'm John Bloom for ArizonaSports.com.